Today I am going to show you how I create this kind of text revealing animation into the After Effects and how I mod this L shape layer. Okay, so without further ado, let's get started. All right, so first of all, we start from uh, Illustrator to create a text or the text shape. So just click uh, create new, give the name of this project text reveal. After that, uh, set the width and height according to a need and just create. So here we create the canvas to select text tool, click anywhere and write anything whatever you want to write like i am writing a play ball i just increase the size of this text so you can see okay so you can see there are lots of fonts over here so i suggest you uh, choose a bold gotham black or gotham fonts or similar of gotham fonts that's the best choice for this kind of animation don't choose uh, something italic or a uh, handwritten fonts because this animation won't work on this type of text so i choose gotham black for this animation align it to the center then just select this shape or object after that go to type and uh, choose create outline so it will converted your text into different shapes you can see here drag out to the group and after that click the layer one and uh, click here the this checkbox go to this option and choose release layer sequences okay select all the layers except one and drag out and delete this layer one because we don't need it after that just save this file and to do this just choose a destination folder in our case uh, i choose a document folder and give the name of this file and make sure the save type selected to adobe illustrator then hit save and click ok go to adobe after effects and create new composition and we set this resolution of this composition to HD 60 FPS and the duration of this composition is 7 seconds. Give the name of this composition like MC, it's a short form of Mancom, and then click OK. After that, double click on this panel, go to the destination folder, which is document, and select the text reveal file which is illustrator file which i created before now it's the important part whenever you import a illustrator layer you have to select composition written layer sizes before click on import button okay so just import it and here is our composition double click on it to open this composition okay here is our text you can see the these are a little bit blurry because it's a rasterized right now so we have to convert it into the vector form so just select all the layers and make sure uh, check this expand or collapse the layer switches panel and click this box to convert raster layers into the vector form right now we can animate it with these layers but i suggest you to convert these illustrator layers into the shape layer so just select all the layers right click go to create and choose create shapes from vector layer all right click one of the illustrator layer box and select label group it help you to select all the illustrator layers because all the illustrator layers has the same colors okay like you can see here so just delete it and now we got the shape layer just rename it for your convenience all right now it's time to animate so i want this l shape to reveal all the other letters okay so just select l shape and uh, at the first frame 
we set the keyframe of position then go to one second further and click again and create a, a one more keyframe here okay so the l positions should be here at the last keyframe so go to the first keyframe and drag this l to something like this check the ram preview okay Select both layers and click F9 to easy ease. You can see the graph of this shape. Alright, just simply select both handles and drag it like this and check the ramp preview. That's nice. Okay, you can do one more movement here. I show you how. Just select last keyframe, copy and paste here and just drag it little bit further okay and don't forget to remove this handle to avoid any unnecessary movement let's play okay we can adjust this all right so that's that's nice now it's time to create a another shape so just deselect this layer and uh, select this box or rectangle tool and just draw a rectangle like this change fill to solid make sure it's connected to this L not here not there it should be connected edge to edge of this L shape layer okay and uh, also uh, should be covered for letters after that give the name of this shape reveal then link this layer to the l shape so when you move the l shape this shape layer follow the l okay now just turn off this shape layer after that go to the effect panel and uh, write down set mat and uh, drop it onto this P shape layer okay and in this take mat from layer option just choose the reveal shape layer now just copy this effect and paste it into all letters except this L turn off this reveal layer to hide it and check the ramp preview okay that's perfectly nice you can see our animation revealing animation is perfectly done over here but uh, i want to add some movement change the color of this shape to recognize it all right just select all the layers go to first frame and hit p to reveal the position properties and make a keyframe over here go to uh, around 30 frames and again make a keyframe here after that uh, go to the first frame and just drag all letters something like this okay that's nice then select all keyframes click f9 to easy ease them go to graph editor select this handle and drag it something like this and check ramp preview nice now we have to adjust them drag this l shape little bit just adjust it according to your need but this is uh, fine for me it's totally up to you how you want to show the motion after that you can morph it the shape layer to uh, increase the smoothness to do this just go to our search bar and type path to reveal this l shape path just make a keyframe at the first frame go to 30 or maybe 10 frames further and create another keyframe over here go to the first frame then select both points and move it to create a single straight line you can see then drag this keyframe further in the timeline something here okay. 
select all the keyframe and press F9 to these. Check the RAM preview. We can also uh, reveal this L shape layer. Just go to the layer, new, null object, and this null, null object position should be bottom of the shape. Okay, and uh, just link this L shape to our null shape. Go to scale properties, click on the stop or create a composition, and link this X and Y values. Then go to a uh, few more frames further and create again key frame. Go to the first frame, here is the X and it is Y value. So decrease the Y value to 0. Check the RAM preview. Don't forget to easy is the second keyframe. Alright. Now I am checking the RAM preview. That's nice. One more thing we can uh, uh, reduce the speed the, our overall animation to do this just simply select all the keyframes hold alt on the keyboard and uh, select this keyframe and drag it over here something like this and just ram preview it you can see how I create this kind of animation into the after effects hope you like this video if you have any question please ask me I will reply you as soon as possible Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.